Come get them, boys. Eh, get a little calendar at the bottom. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yep. Yep, there's totally stuff over there. Apparently, this shop set up right below what was effectively made in a bit. Okay, that was too cheap. Shit. I've ruined my shop. I am going to be completely undone now. This is unsustainable. Somebody look at the water so I know if 100's too much. Yeah. Okay, that's cheap. 20 is still too cheap. 1 is too cheap. And I didn't pay attention to what he sold that for. Maybe it's just, like, decent? I don't know. You, you can't- you cannot stand there, old man, and get impatient with me for not walking up to the counter. I, I can't transcend time and space. Well, I can send tra I can transcend time, but not space. Alright. <laughs> I don't think I've sold one of these yet. Yeah, because it doesn't show anything. If I select this and move over here... No, it does. And I've not sold any yet, so... 15 is good enough, because that's what I sold it for. I can put stacks down! Oh, I can sell all nine of them. Okay. So, five apiece? 45? That's probably good enough. I... I'm not retarded. You're retarded. <laughs> Alright, I sold that for five and they were happy. So, we'll sell this for 50. One. <laughs> I'm a jerk. <laughs> Alright. Uh, glass lenses. We have not sold you yet, so we need to know what your price is. We'll start you at 20. And we've not sold you. And you're, you have crystal in the name, so we can sell you for homeopath homeopathy at 100. Beautiful. Buy my shiny crystal stuff. Can I go back in the jump? I can't. Oh, and I can use my storage while I'm back here. He does not like... Four... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, they have to pay 405. I'm still only marking them per. Gotcha. Uh, and how much did I determine teeth were worth? Nothing, I don't know yet. We'll say 10. And then roots were worth 5, so 50's probably too much. You never know. They were happy with five, so we'll put it at six. And then the crystal, we have no idea. And glass lenses? Did we just sell one of those? No. Somebody's got to come over here and buy it. Yeah, she was really happy with whatever I was selling it for. And they like they like the crystal at a hundred. Would you come closer to the cash register, please? You dumb pile of adventurer. <laughs> Empowering crystal. Uh, don't know. You were happy at 100. So we're going to go up to 110. 111. Because we're difficult like that. Because we're happy. At, nope, that's good. We don't know yet. Oh, no, no, no. 10 was too much. Okay. So we'll go down to 4. What else do we have to sell? Um, iron bar again. Well, I know this stuff sells for a decent amount. Yeah, 20 was good. So we'll put it up to 30. All right. Buy my shit. No! You're not happy with that price. Four is still too much. No, he didn't check it. Wait, what are you angry at? Excuse me. You're you're angry that I didn't put it down to... What is it four? Okay. 111 is still too cheap. That's fine. We don't have any more of those to sell. The iron bars were reasonable, yeah. It does. It disappears if I move windows before I actually set it down. All right, 21 was fine, so... How much more can we push that? 25, probably. No, not 35. 35 is too much. Thanks, though. Appreciate it. 20 is a steal. So... 30 must be even better. Buy my stuff. I'll put the money back into the town. Cool. That's a good price. Four. So five is probably also fine. A 
son of bitch. I could have sold for even more. Two of them. Huh. So it doesn't matter how many I sell up here. That doesn't play into it at all. So I can always sell stacks. Oh, sh okay. I'll there you go. I need to put stuff down. Uh, I can put that whetstone with that whetstone. How do I pick up a stack again? Stop! You're ru Stop! You're ruining my life! Hold to grab stack. That's uh, more intuitive than I'd like to admit because I'm dumb. Nine is super affordable. So 20 must be a good price. And we don't want to sell too much of the same thing. And I'm being dumb. Stop. Put that down. Uh, we have not sold too many roots, have we? Roots sold for... Yeah, six was good. So seven is even better. <laughs> I should stop making that because it's not a joke. And vines. They hated three. They hated three, but they loved one. So it's a crapshoot if two is good or not. <laughs> Alright. Mm. And then the broken rusty swords appeared to be pretty decently. So yeah, 20 was still within the you're charging too little category. So 50, I guess. Y you just you just enjoying that furnace there, old man, huh? I found no relics. Go away. 50 is still too cheap. I feel like I need to restart this game with my time powers. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, wait, no. They thought 20 was too high for the whetstone. Okay. So we'll go back down to 15. <laughs> Zero. And you liked... You liked it at two. Okay, that's perfect. Not a crapshoot. Boop. Welcome. And that's it. Um, tooth stones. That's what it is. Tooth stones went down to medium. Everything else is high popularity. This is, uh... This is actually a pretty decent sim. I like it. It's not overly complicated, but there's still enough there to manage and understand. Alright, you can go in here as well, because you're still in high demand. I don't know what you're worth. We'll also charge 16, because we're just that way. Alright, we'll combine you, combine these, and then Jelly? Jelly was solding, solding for quite a bit, yeah? Five was happy. Yeah, we'll leave it at five. Psych! And I'm gonna go put the other things in storage. So we can actually get enough! Let me go back into Land of Happy. There we go, everything. See you later. Oh wait, are both of those treasure boxes? Yes, I have two. And I bet you, I bet you, if I upgrade the shop, I'm gonna get more storage. So I have, what, 800-ish? 700-something? Yeah. Shop. Do I feel that dungeons are too hard? Oh, okay, so weapon forge, potions, and I can buy one of both of those, but only one. The shop expands, allows merchants to decorate it to please their customers as well as additional space for their items. I can decorate it, that's cute. Uh... So it increases the length, that increases the width, so I get two more spaces. For 60,000, just to get two more spaces, that's ridiculous. But I get another treasure box for storage. Uh, and brand new quest points, so merchants can receive customer requests, that's cool. Shop expansion adds a shop assistant, extra shop, a shop assistant, I wonder how that works. No, stop underselling, no, stop overselling, you piece of crap, you don't know what you're doing. This is my shop, you're ruining my name. Um, okay, and then I can just buy furniture, effectively. We'll add an extra 10% tip, just straight up. It just makes money. It doesn't coerce the customer into a 10% tip. It just makes money. Beautiful. I mean, in a world of instance dungeons in real life in this game, magic money making cash registers makes sense. Extra health in the morning. So, you have a reason to go to bed. Cute. Extra space for your items. A sale box? 
Huh. I wonder I wonder how that works. Like it actually takes 75% of what your original price was it was for it. So people are more inclined to buy it? Like a modifier on customer perception? Eh. I'm not no marketing guy. Alright, let's see. Let's buy one of these, because why the hell not? More weapons? Or the wooden hat. Oh, that's cute. Find potions and enchantments for this and that. Um, I want to hit things better. Yes, it is 10 p.m. Start building right now. You don't have a choice. In fact, build it immediately. <laughs> oh my god. I was really expecting it to be like, no, go do a dungeon first. But no, nah, it's just here. It took him three seconds. Time flow. Time is convoluted in Lordran. You must be well, no? The one who requested my forge? My name is Andre. Andre! Okay. Forge master extraordinaire. And if it's weapons or armor you seek, Vulcan's forge is the place. Oh, this is cool. More mechanics. That's fine. Dude, would you be intimidated if you walked into a shop and the shopkeeper was just wearing full plate mail? Or would you be so just kick ass, man? I'm buying everything. Okay, so this actually requires that I bring stuff in. Making the shops is just money, but making materials and crafting requires that I... Oh, you know what? I bet you we're gonna make stuff. We're gonna collect things and make stuff explicitly for the purpose of reselling it. That seems to be like endgame. Min-maxing, anyway. Fist. Really? Fist weapons. Just, just fist weapons. That's fine. That, that's good. I love you. I'll come back later. Because I got adventuring to do. I got my Zelda ass sword and shield that I gotta go exercise before I buy any of your stuff. Parallax, scroll me off the screen, please. No? Okay. And it's just recessed into the ground. Ha! I made it past the dungeon. Can't stop me. Why would I be able to go up here? There's nothing up here. There's no Easter eggs. There's nothing. I appreciate the freedom that you didn't just make an invisible wall, but also, like, give me something. Like, even if it's just a little block of ten gold, it would be basically... Uh... Insignificant, but it would still give you a little bit of a I-didn't-waste-my-time feeling when you go into the secret places you didn't block off. It'd be like forgetting to model a room. All right, A is attack and squares block. Got gotcha. you. All right, let's kill some squids. Or are they kids? No, in fact, they're jellies. Thank you, though, for your contribution. Please go back to the special boy room. I thought you took a while to. Oh my God, that's the other dungeon. Why are you so inconsistent with your attacks? Jeez. Dude, is that blocked off or can I go through? Oh my god, it's a secret. Ah! Ah! He's warping space! Oh my... No, stop, stop. Whatever it is you're doing. I don't like it. I died. And I just lost everything. I don't have enough stuff to sell tomorrow. Okay, you don't lose what's on your person. You only lose what's in your bag. Is that the only penalty? Excuse me? I just get to start over. Okay. Well, as we've learned, we're a little bitch boy, and we don't have the capacity to go into realm of not this place yet. We gotta build some stronger wapons. Or get good, but that's never the option for me. We're playing on hard, though. You can always lower it. Just bitch out that way. Heh. <sighs> More stuff to sell. Those things actually sold for quite a bit, didn't they? Stop! Stop what you're doing. Oh, I was really expecting the big one to turn into a bunch of small ones. He did not. How disappointing. Those are rocks. Good job, me. This isn't the same dungeon, is it? Also, 
Do I have to spend... Yeah. You can't leave. Unless you've got 200 gold. This is cool. I imagine that restores health. Why? Why do our tools keep disappearing? Chambers full of precious stone are left untouched, but rooms and chests holding our most basic tools keep vanishing. Huh. So is that telling me that I can't put stuff on the ground, or is that just telling me that I'm going to run into rooms that have the pickaxes and whatnot that I need later on? Okay, don't stand on the crumble bits. They make dead happen. Iron! Aha, I dodged you. I, I pressed the dodge button! Stop. You're embarrassing yourself. We killed a golem, though. That's nice. Um, what is this? Water lamp. Is that equipment? Oh, that's cool. Um, nope, can't equip it. All right, then. Hello. Are you my friend? Clearly not. Dude, did he drop an ice cream sandwich? Oh, is this the exit? That's an exit. All right, so that's how you save your 200 gold. You actually have to make it to an exit. That's nice. I like it. You don't have to go back to the beginning, which wouldn't make any sense, which is why I was kind of avoiding it. It doesn't feel like progress. That's because it's not. More ice cream sandwiches. Son of a... There's no wind-up for... I'm pressing the dodge button! <laughs> Fine, I'll just bait you out. I'll do it the just stupid bitch way. Fine. Oh my god, he should have killed me with that last hit. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see. Those ice cream sandwiches are hardened steel. No, they're ice cream sandwiches. Oh, hey, okay, the door's closed. That's fine. 